What's up, everybody? It's Kobe Robinson. Go by Self Pay Kobe on Instagram. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe on Girls Mentality. This episode two, season two. And uh, run these views up. Share with friends and family members. Leave a like button. And make sure you run these views up, like I said, bruh. My cousin in the head, that's why I couldn't even sleep. Now I'm riding around with the heat. I know anybody can be against me. What's up, my boys? We got episode two, season two. You know what I'm saying? Brothers mentality, we back. You know what I'm saying? Back in action with another one. Gotta throw my shades on. We got another uh, special guest for us. I'm Daryl. <laughs> I'm Tyrone. I'm Bean. <laughs> Cheers. But, yeah. Not the scene, so let's get it, man. We're gonna turn up. Got a few topics. And shit, we're gonna get into it like we always do. For sure, for sure. Nah, what I wanna review today, I wanna review. Uh, I want to review the Dave Chappelle situation. Like, how y'all feel about this? So, Dr. Dave Chappelle <laughs> responds to his backlash for his comedy special. He say he will not be removed. My thing is, everybody too sensitive. My nigga been like that. The times have changed. So, you see how sensitive people done got over time. Because, at one point, because I used to watch the Dave Chappelle show. That bitch was so funny. For real. Uh, like I said, he's one of my favorite comedians, and he just so original. And um, you know, I know a lot of people look up to him in the comedian world. But my thought, like I said, world too soft. You can't say nothing without people getting offended. And you can't do nothing. Yeah, they, they soft for real. But bro, I think it's just a, a race thing, honestly. Like, let a white man would have said this shit, bro. That's true. It, it, it's it wouldn't. Even, true. It wouldn't even got this deep at all. It wouldn't got this deep at all. They trying to cancel my boy. Yeah. But you guys, you also gotta think about it too, is that Dave Chappelle, this nigga been in the game, this nigga been in the game for a long time, like you said, and like, people just don't understand the magnitude of what, what he be saying on screen, like, it's the same way like with uh, Eddie Murphy, when Eddie Murphy was cussing and stuff like on stage and stuff with the red suit, I mean with the red leather. They said he was saying racist. They said he was But, in a, in a, in a comedian, let me see that bit. In the comedian world, that's what that's that's you gonna touch on everything. So they points and they views, it really be real life. But like I said, people don't really like to hear the truth. He really, he really all his skits and stuff based on like true stuff. He just put his own little um comedic stuff in it to make it funny and all that stuff. But all his content, real life stuff, like that's how he that's how he based all his stuff around. So if it happened to be shit, it's real, real racist shit happened in real life. So you know what I'm saying? Of course, that's gonna come along. That's all I gotta say, man. Just, nigga, too soft, bro. That's the end of that, bro. He just too real. Y'all, y'all heard the part about his friend Daphne, bro. About what? Daphne, bro. You, you watched the You watched it. Talking about the Netflix thing? He ain't watch it. Oh, oh. No, he on Netflix. Oh. No, bro, he got to He got say tell me about it, cause I'm, but I might wanna watch it. He gotta watch it, man. Don't bro, he got. He got a trans. He got a transgender. Female friend, bro. <laughs> so, so they started. They started trying to cancel him for real. Like when he did sticks and stones, they started trying to cancel him. So she was defending that nigga on Twitter, like going hard up behind him, like going crazy. The, all the, the LGBTQ community, bro, they they was on her ass, and she killed us like six days later. So who who really who really bad, bro? Him or them, like. Exactly. Like, exactly. they made her kill herself. Like, like I said, when you see that bitch, make sure they hit me, man. <laughs> make sure y'all hit me through the headphone. Bruh. I don't want to get into the topic of that, but it's like a lot of stuff brought upon that situation be coming from the same, the same people that be saying, this was offensive, this was that. You doing the same thing. <laughs> Talking shit. And like, you know what I'm saying, doing all that, bro, it's the same, it's the same concept. So a lot of people, they be pretty much hypocrites mm-hmm. of their own stuff. And I see that a lot. I wanna say the baby, you can kinda you can kinda put in there similar because the so-called new council stuff, the council cu- culture, what they call it, mm-hmm. where they come from, bro? Bro, people say what they say, that's what they wanna say. You can't really get mad. Everybody entitled to their own opinion. That's the problem. Nobody 
people want their own opinion, but at the same time, they don't. It don't make sense. So a lot of people be hypocrites on their own statements and their own little judgments and stuff. Well, you you is right about that. You know what I'm saying? People people uh, fall to down like always. Like they don't realize what they be saying or what they be doing in the midst of doing things in their own little world or their own little fantasy and what they doing because once they feel this that they out exposed to the world and stuff, they feel bad about what they done done. It always happens. People say all kind of stuff when they not famous or right. they ain't got no kind of attention on them, and then it end up coming back around on them. Right. Because it's another situation about the I don't know his name. I forgot his name, but the Raiders coach. Yeah, he yeah, got fired. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He, he got fired because of that. They say he was saying racist stuff. Say he was doing a lot of stuff. I don't really know too much about it, mm-hmm. but I heard a little bit about it. But I mean, that's people. It's people, bro. I mean, you'll be surprised. But for that, for that money, niggas will hide that shit. They'll for be, real, for real. You know what I'm saying? But they say he was out open with it, but people ain't never really want to believe it. Mm-hmm. But you'll be surprised, bro. The world, like. It's, it's, it's way it's way much bigger than a Black Lives Matter situation. And I'm not gonna get into that, but I'm just saying it's, no. it's 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 a it's it's way bigger than what people think it is. Like, and I'm just speaking it for uh, us blacks. Like, we done been through a lot. White people don't know the you know what I'm saying the struggle and what the pain we done cost. You know what I'm saying behind like our ancestors. Yeah, to it. Yeah. Because even though times have changed. It's still lower class people that's not just black though. So some people, but I, I ain't gonna get into that. But like I'm gonna say, it's, it's some people down there, <laughs> different races, including white people as well. Right. But it's that, 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 that grain of people that think they're not in that class because they white or because they this and that. That be the problem. People be want to be what they not. Mm-hmm. You right here down with us. Right. Stop exactly. trying to, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. So, yeah. Just because you got materialistic or money in your pocket doesn't mean you da 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 Some people feel entitled because of how they look. Right. That's that's more than just race. That's good looks, everything. Mm-hmm. Some people just feel entitled to have stuff because of it. And it ain't real. In some cases it is, though. In some cases, they let some shit slide because right. of how you look, where you from, stuff like that. So I can't say it ain't true, but it's a lot of cases where it don't happen because they thought it was true. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It happens though. Everyday world, everyday world. Mm-hmm. Another thing too, I want to recover, cover on is what's going on with my nigga Kyrie. Ah, what's going on, with my nigga Kyrie? He doing right. Fuck that. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> hey, let me let me say one. Let me say one thing. Let me say one thing. Let me say one thing. I, Kyrie, Kyrie, he always bring drama every time when he get to a team. Okay, that's normal. We should all we should all should get that get that clear. <laughs> but this, people, situ- yeah. I feel, I feel is that in my opinion, I feel is that this situation is way different because oh, yeah. he's standing on for what he believe in. He's standing on for what he, you know, he's a human being just like us. If he don't want to take the shot, damn it, he don't got to take. Fall into the same category. I'm telling you, like I said, man, look. I'd heard a lot about now. This is what I'd heard a lot about. The thing now is, people don't like you said. Just like in opinions, it's the same concept. Mm-hmm. Now you don't got the right to do what you want to do with your own body. If you don't do what they say do, then you gotta go. Uh, you getting fired and uh, all this and that. What a f- nigga! It's amendments for this shit. So y'all telling me y'all going back on stuff we, that's been written, mm-hmm. even though that always happened. You might not know, but man, look, you should have the right to do what you want to do with your body. Mm-hmm. Anyway, you shouldn't be blocked from your money because you you know what I'm saying. It just hell, it's damn near worse just being racist, right. shit. Because you, damn, it's the same concept. You splitting somebody because they not what you want them to be. That's that's your opinion. But now, nah, Kyrie, man, I don't blame him, bro. He's standing up for some that you know. Bigger than the, bigger than him, like I said, he said he's bigger than basketball. So, bigger than basketball. so you can't be mad at him. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, he had caused many problems in the past. Yeah, we should, like I said, <laughs> we should all, we should all know that's normal by him. Right. But this, I feel that this situation, he's standing on for, 
for what's you know what I'm saying for for what's he's standing for himself. You know what I'm saying for one, yeah. Like you say it's bigger you said, than the NBA. It's big. It's way bigger than that. But that, that's why I said people belittle you because they feel like they don't they don't respect the individual. It's just what you associated with. Mm-hmm. So since he associated with the NBA. That's all you're going to hear. And not just him, him. Don't worry. He ain't got nothing to do with the team. He ain't got nothing to do with all that. He don't want to take it, so he don't going to take it. And he going to take whatever consequence it's, it's behind it. So that's all it is. What you got on your mind, Bean? What you got on your mind, Bean? Yeah, bro. All uh, right, so, so for, that, for, for that bread, would you take that shot, bro? Like, you going to leave no, all that behind? I don't care how much bread in the world. <laughs> I'm not. Cause you don't know the long. My thing is, I believe we didn't. We didn't talk about this. Yo, we didn't recover. I ain't gonna go get too deep in it. But all I'm gonna say is, I believe in your own immune system. I believe if you take care of your body the right way, ain't it? You, you damn near got the best chance of living longer than you want to live. Mm-hmm. But when it come down to them damn shots and shit, I done learned a lot before before this even came along. I learned a lot about them. You never read really, most vaccines and stuff like that. You don't really never it prepare you for something, but it not really have you protected it. from it. Yeah. How in the hell the damn you gonna get COVID still from the vaccine? That's what I'm saying. Bro. Like I was saying, I done learned a lot about it. I might not know everything about every vaccine in history, but I know this one for sure. Do what you want to do, my nigga. I ain't gonna tell nobody what to do with their body. That's on you, but me, I'm good. Take my chance. You take your chance. How you take it? That's just how it's supposed to be. Ain't America supposed to be free, bitch? Let <laughs> me do what I want to do. But nah, for real, bro. I agree with you. Don't know the you don't know the long term effects of it. Yeah. That's my main priority thing. It ain't even been a whole year yet. You think I'm going to get something? I don't know what can happen from it. That's like getting a car and you don't know what's wrong with it. And then by your ear, you over, your shit fucked up. Now you need a new motor. But the motor that. was already messed up. <clears throat> They don't even let us go into the president situation with the vaccine. We ain't even know the coffee. Real talk. We just hopped in that business. But that, so man, that, that, that vaccine, man, like, bro. Then, then it's like people saying it's getting worse because, you know what I'm saying, uh, kids like our age are dying from it. Even though I ain't heard of nobody. That's the one I'm, that's all I'm saying. But like, anybody died from it, you know what I'm saying? No disrespect. I'm just saying, I ain't, I don't know nobody. I look at the, into the facts, bro. Why does he let me just say it? Pressure, pressure on you to get the, get the shot. Right. That's all it is to me, though. How you feel about a bean? You got any more stuff? Bro, I'm, your body supposed to heal itself, but that's all I gotta say. Like, you don't need no vaccine. Your body supposed to heal itself. I don't learn that much. Take care of it. I know that much. That why we got red blood cells and all that good shit. White blood cells, all that stuff. Ain't what no, it do? Ain't no Bill Nye the Science guy, bro. I mean, oh God, though. No, I ain't no, I ain't no scientist, <clears throat> but I ain't no dummy. <laughs> um, another thing I want to review um, about this DC, DC, uh, <laughs> DC. Uh, now I ain't gonna get into the the baby or Boosie or you know what I'm saying. I'm not gonna be nothing like that, but. They had us treat for a long time, thinking, you know what I'm saying, like, uh, like I'm, I'm kind of, you know what I'm saying, I'm agreeing with Boosie on, a, on, a, on one end, on a certain like, fact, you know what I'm saying, but at the same time, it's like, you, you, you made this for kids, man, and, you, and you, these, these niggas gay. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want these kids to come out gay, man. They're like Lil Boosie said. He said, he said that now you you let your kids uh, go to go to go to uh, Lil Nas X concert, Nick. I mean, uh, Lil Nas X Nick on, on, Bro, it's on bigger, stage. It's bigger than what people like think. Like, cause I feel like it's just force. That's all. Yeah. I ain't got nothing wrong with no gay person. You yeah, know I ain't saying? got nothing wrong. With ain't nothing wrong with it. But my only thing is. Don't just force it on some upon somebody that don't even know. Right, yeah. right, right. They don't even know what life is. I think they they forcing it on people so much to where you like you you gotta give your opinion. They putting it in your face. Mm. They want you to say something. Bro. That's how I feel. They want yeah. you to put it. My thing is like I said, bro. A lot of it be extra, bro. For real, a lot of it don't be cause for. You have your stuff. Do what you do. They ain't got nothing to do with it. But like we saying, when it come to kids, bro. 
like so young. Mm -hmm. I just remember when I was young, like you so influenced, like anything, TV, all that's still real influential. So when it come down to that, bro, and kids should just be learning stuff that that they need to learn, mm -hmm. essential stuff. That stuff ain't important. You know what I'm saying? That stuff not important. So kids should just be learning how to count, how to do all this stuff, man. Right, how to right, fucking right. work, how to live in the world, pretty much. But they learning so early about stuff that niggas ain't learn about way on till exactly. you was older. I ain't know what a gay person was at like 10. Nah, I'll take that back. <laughs> maybe, I don't, maybe I just thought they were different, bro. I was like, man, he just different, bro. Like, he weird or something, like, <laughs> He's just different, bro. Mm -hmm. But I don't know, like like I said, what I know today, I didn't know back then. It's been a mess, but it's a blessing. Run up on me and I'm busting my whip. Decided I'm preaching, I feel like a reverend. I can't feel your love, it's like you wasn't present. My love for you, it can never go away. Without you, my life hasn't been the same. All of this shit is fucking with my brain. Shooting the target, they don't got a name.